Kia ora, and welcome to the University of Canterbury Information Evening on the Bachelor of Health Sciences. Kia ora tata, ko te poho o tamatia toko moanga, ko pauho toko awa, ko pakiha toko iwi, ko luruman toko hapu, no ototahi aho, ko Tracy Clellan toko ingoa, no reira, kia ora koutou. So welcome, welcome and kia ora from the School of Health Sciences. My name is Tracy Cleland and I'm a lecturer in the Bachelor of Health Sciences degree. I'm also the coordinator of the degree, making sure that our students have a great experience here at the University of Canterbury. And one of those experiences is making sure they get the opportunity to connect with other students. Health at the moment is on everyone's mind. With the coronavirus pandemic affecting people across the world, health is at the forefront of everyone's waking life at the moment. We've had our nurses, doctors and healthcare workers on the front line as essential workers. Never before have public health and health promotion been so prevalent in our society. We've all had to adapt and adjust our lives. At what level we can have sports gathering, when we can go back to school, a supermarket spending shows we're buying and eating more although not always the healthy options. So your health, my health, everyone's health is so important. But what exactly is health? Health, according to the World Health Organization, is defined as a state of complete physical, mental, and social well-being, and not merely the absence of disease. Modern healthcare is now increasingly focused on population wellness, disease prevention, and delivering health services to the community. The health, health workforce is diverse and interdisciplinary. So studying health at UC, health is becoming more about wellness and prevention with a stronger focus on the community and not just individuals. Therefore, what can you expect while studying health at UC? You can expect actively engaged experts, diverse research programs, coherent, connected and relevant programs, evidence-informed action, solving real world problems and opening doors to exciting careers. As part of studying health at UC, you'll have the opportunity to engage in internships in the community. Here, theory meets practice and practice meets theory. So studying health at UC, health spans across different subjects and degrees at UC. You can do a bachelor's degree in health sciences, but you can also focus on sport coaching, on social work, on speech and language pathology. Subjects are diverse, such as audiology, communication disorders, counselling, environmental health, health behaviour change, health information management, health sciences, biology, psychology, and much more. So let's start with a Bachelor of Health Sciences degree. In the Bachelor of Health Sciences degree, you can choose to major in one or two majors. As you can see, we offer environmental health, health education, Māori and Indigenous Health, Psychology, Public Health, and Society and Policy. Each of these majors can be taken as just a single major and combined with other papers across the university, or as mentioned, you can choose to do a double major. Environmental Health looks at the geographical distribution of disease, exposure to key risk factors and methods used to minimize exposure government legislation aimed at creating and maintaining healthy environments. You will develop an understanding of risk factors in the natural and built environment, underlying biological processes and the scientific methods used to investigate, monitor and assess the effects of environmental hazards, such as pollution. In health education, it is quite different. It prepares you for the knowledge, skills and confidence to work with individuals and groups to ensure well-being, It allows you to develop specific health education knowledge to apply in a diverse range of settings and contexts, such as mental health and sexuality. Health education offers one of the very few papers in sexuality education. Māori and Indigenous Health uses and applies and integrates Māori, bicultural and Indigenous knowledge and practices in a wide range of chosen health and social services careers. Here, you will look at the holistic view of Māori health and wellbeing. You'll engage with Māori, you'll understand the Te Tiriti, the treaty. 
you'll understand interpersonal and cross-cultural communication dialogue and Māori health issue-based experiences. You'll also work with health professionals and you'll have a much better understanding of how to work across health systems. In psychology, psychology is the scientific study of behaviour and associated biological, cognitive and social processes in humans is a rapidly developing field touching on all aspects of human life. Advances in neuroimaging and molecular biology are rapidly enhancing our understanding of how the brain works, while increasingly complex theories are being developed to understand both normal and abnormal development and the behaviour of individuals and groups. In public health, you'll improve health and well-being through disease prevention, health promotion and health service planning, delivery and evaluation. Public health major will provide you with the knowledge and skills to operate effectively in health sector organisations such as the District Health Board. And as we have seen over the last six weeks, public health will continue to grow as a field in New Zealand. This will be an area where they'll be needing a lot more employees in the future. And finally, you can choose from society and policy. This focuses on the relationships between health science, health governance, bioethics and society. And again, society and policy major will help develop the skills that you need to look at policy going forward in New Zealand. So the Bachelor of Health Science is a three year degree. As you can see from the following diagram, in year one, you will have some key core courses, such as Introduction to Health Studies, Māori Health Issues and Opportunities, Epidemiology and Human Biology. You will then have other papers that go with the core may of the major that you have chosen, such as in this example, 111, which is a major in public health. You will also then have some other alternatives, such as three papers at the 100 level, which you can choose from across the university. However, students who choose to double major can find that they will have no spare spaces. In fact, both all of their spaces will be full with the double majors. So it's a great opportunity to either do one major in some of the subjects that you enjoy or do a double major in the areas we have already discussed. Practical experiences. Practical experiences are crucial in any degree. Our health students have a range of opportunities to apply their skills in practical and professional environments from clinics to internships. Students have completed internships with places such as the Cancer Society, the CDHB and Pegasus Health. You'll also be connecting a lot with your students, your fellow students in classrooms through practical experience. Actively engaged experts. The other reason why you want to do health at University of Canterbury is you will be taught by some of the experts from nationally and international organizations. So for example, Professor Leanne Woodward is doing a lot of research at the moment at, on the international stage around preterm babies. Annabelle is doing research around Māori and Indigenous health. And Sarah Blubble looks at community health and also sexual and reproductive health. The key here is that our lecturers take an interprofessional approach to teaching. You'll learn from national and international experts in a range of health areas. What about graduate careers? A lot of people ask us about what careers come out of this degree. So far, our health graduates have been employed at the ACC, Cancer Society, Pegasus Health, Endometriosis New Zealand, and a wide range of other organizations that you can see on this slide. According to Suli, one of our ex-graduates, health and well-being is crucial to both an individual and to society as a whole. This degree sets you up with the knowledge Base to face crucial health issues relating to society today. You can see here again Suli working with the Pacifica community. Also Taylor Gray. Taylor Gray is one of my ex-students who majored in health education. She is now the National Health Educator for Endometriosis New Zealand. She states, if you have a passion for helping people and communities and have an interest in health, you should go for it. This degree will be one of the best decisions you ever made. There are so many different paths you can follow within the Bachelor of Health Science. So thank you for listening. We really hope you're inspired to look at health at the University of Canterbury. So connect, be active, take notice, 
give and keep learning. And if you're not sure, these are the five ways to well-being that underpin so much of health in New Zealand today. Thank you for listening and we'll see you soon at the University of Canterbury. Ka kite anna.